Hey y'all, so it was raining out and I was going to do this outside, but it was still wet. But I still wanted to read to you guys um, Elizabeth Acevedo's newest book. It's called Inheritance and it is a visual poem. So I hope you guys enjoy it. Like, no, this isn't the usual, you know, for Chapter Friday. This is a read aloud. <laughs> Alright. Oh, and if I miss say some words, mispronounce them, I apologize ahead of time. All right, so it's called Inheritance by Elizabeth Acevedo, or by Andrea Pippen. Right. Some people tell me to fix my hair, and by fix, they mean straighten, they mean whiten. But how do you fix this shipwrecked history of hair? The true meaning of standard. Nope. The true meaning of stranded. When tresses hug tight like African cousins and ship bellies. Did our ancestors imagine that their great-grandchildren will look like us and would try to escape them how we do? Finding ways to erase them from our skin, to iron them out of our hair. This wild tangle of hair that strangles air. Some call them wild curls, but I call them breathing, antecedent spiraling. Can't you see them in this wet hair that waves like, hello? We're told the Dominicans do the best hair. We can wash, set, flatten the spring in any lock. But what they mean is we are the best at swallowing amnesia in a cup of mirror sanado. Die dreaming, because it seems easier to do that than live in this reality. Caught between orange juice and milk. between reflections of the sun and whiteness. But what they mean is, why would you date a black man? What they mean is, un frito cocolo. What they mean is, why would two oppressed people come together? is two times the trouble. What they really mean is, have you thought of your daughter's hair? And I don't tell them that my love and I are like sugar cane. Dark skin, paler flesh, meshed in pure sweetness, the children of children of fields. Our bodies curve into each other like an echo, and I let my curtain of curls blanket us from the world.
our children will be beautiful, of dusk skin and brilliant eyes. Hair or reclamation. Oh, how I will braid pride down their backs from the moment they leave the womb. They will be born in love with themselves. Some people tell me to fix my hair and so many words remain unspoken because all I can reply is, you can't fix what was never broken. <laughs>